all right what is up guys we are back today with some more news we're just right here in the lobby with everyone just chilling but we're about to get into this news let's go all right guys we are back so here we go we're getting into the news today starting off with uh let's go Artix has been getting DDoS attack lately, and that is why um, not only Galley but Artix, along with those two, have been like either not working at all or like people can connect at intervals. It'll disconnect you. This is the reason. If anyone has any info surrounding the attacker, please follow this link right here. They will reward you with cash, in game currency, or other compensations. Moving on from that, we have a new drop tonight from the first boss of the AIC concert, which. If I think about it right, I'm assuming that they're going to put on drops for the other two bosses as well. So maybe we'll get a cape and um, a cape and a weapon from the next one, and from the last one we'll get the armor, and it'll be a complete set. That's what I think. I think it would be pretty dope. I have the helmets already. I think they're absolutely fire. Definitely can't wait to see what they do with the bosses. Moving on from that, and moving on from there, we have a baby play with a baby Yoda which is from the Mandalorian, if you didn't know. It's a Star Wars type spinoff. Absolutely love this cape because I've been watching it myself on the fourth episode. I think it's really dope. Good job, Lay. Moving on from there, we have a new and updated version of the Void Gatekeeper armor. Apparently this is the new ones versus the old ones. Kind of reminding me of like a chunky navel almost with how the little robe there goes i really like it i think it's dope i won't be getting it myself of course because i don't like um nilgoth colored items anyways moving on from there i don't know if i covered this in my last video but hero mart has a 70 dollars sale going on for six of the moglins from the moglin kickstarter and if you order these you will get the dark master of moglins armor helm and class art which I'm guessing it's just a reskin of Master of Moglins, which if that's the case, then that is a really good deal considering people paid $100 for that class. You'll get almost $30 off for the class and you'll get a cool ass armor with it. Moving on from that, we have the Shadow Slayer Z set and another set of flames. So if you remember, there was a, a fire and ice styled blade that came out recently towards summer and you got a pet which opened a shop which gave you the blades and the cape and all that. There was a red and a blue version of these capes, so they're bringing a black version with Black Friday along with this set, which I will be getting the cape if I can just get the cape. I'm sure I will, and I'm going to really like that. I don't know about the male version of this armor. I haven't seen anything related to that yet, so we'll just have to see. Other, other than that, I think the sword's really dope. Um, I don't know if this will be a part of a drop, because I know she said there was drops. Um... Because like I was saying with the whole Act 1, Act 2, Act 3 thing, this might be part of the drops because she did say there was more Black Friday drops coming. Other than that, we'll just have to wait to see what they come up with because it's pretty much up in the air at this moment what they're going to do and how they're going to deliver us updates. Moving on from there, we have a really dope cyber house coming. It is the Cyber Shadowfall house. You will, I'm sure it's going to be exactly like Shadowfall, just in a cyber form. Um... Looks like we might be getting two new versions, or maybe it's just the same one that was unfinished. Either way, looking really dope. I'm definitely getting this house. Can't wait to see it. And finally, for the news today, we have the Dark Fiend of Nolgath armor, Guys of Nolgath Shadow Overfiend blade, all coming to Black Friday, which are having color custom um, item parts. So I'm guessing the green jewel and the yellow parts of the blade are color custom along with the helmet. Okay, yeah, never mind. Down here she says that they are armor post sword eyes are color custom to eye color and green gem on the armor and face and the blade are color custom to accessory. So we will definitely be getting that Cyber Monday suggestion. <laughs> Either way, thank you all for watching. I hope you all enjoyed. That's all the news I have for today. Um, if anything changes, if I get any more updates before the event drops, then I will update with a video. If not, I'm just going to continue doing a house tour video, stuff like that, until the events come. And I will be covering those events because they are my favorite two events of the year. And that's pretty much it. So if you guys enjoyed, leave a like, subscribe, and share with your friends. Thank you all for watching, and I will see you all in the next one later.